spot as well. Third down and ten for Rodgers. Running out of options and then going down. And a flag comes down at the end there. Illegal use of hands. Hands to the face. Defense. Number 90. Five-yard penalty from the previous spot. First down. See if he gets him to the face there. Right now he's on the shoulder pad. He's still on the shoulder pad. I'm trying to figure out when does he actually put hands to the face there. I got a, I got a shoulder. Williams is slot to the near side motioning out. There's Rodgers. They drop into coverage against Rodgers. And it's incomplete as he was looking for Allison. And flag is down. Prior to the pass, holding defense. Number 21. Five yards penalty from the previous spot. Automatic first step. Number 21, Tracy Walker there. Personal foul. Face mask. Number 98 defense. 15-yard penalty. This is like what happened Automatic in the Baltimore down, Jacksonville game, game this year. Extended for one play. But in that case, they got Jacksonville a field goal. had enough, uh, you know, with the penalty, enough yardage to be able to be in field goal range for the winning kick by Myers. Devin Taylor. I don't know. Did they get the face mask? Cowboys 46. This is the play we were talking about. Stafford to Pettigrew. Looks like he's face guarded by the Dallas Cowboys. Flag on the play. Game changer. Anthony Hitchens looks like he face guarded him. Des Bryant comes out without his helmet to argue. No flag on that. And then the flag that was thrown on this was picked up. You can't never it. touch the guy, huh? What is yeah, up with that? Not only did he grabbed it. For the Packers, we'll see how well he can go here. Play action to open up the second half. Rodgers over the middle and broken up at the end there. And that was a big hit that Allison took. You see the medical staff quick to get out to Allison. Personal foul. Unnecessary roughness. Defense. Number 21. in motion. Stafford looking the other way. Sidearm sling to the end zone. Oh, what a catch. Touchdown. Kenny Galladay. This is incomplete, but like you were saying, you think it's a catch. So is it clear and obvious? See, Probably and not. And Dean, they called a touchdown initially, so is it going to be enough to reverse that? That would be the question, correct? After reviewing the play, the pass is in. Five yard line, two plays later. Hill looking for Calvin Johnson again. It appears to be a game winning touchdown catch for Calvin Johnson. The ball comes loose, as you can see it. When Calvin goes down, it is ruled an incomplete pass on the field. The play, of course, would be reviewed as we see it again. Johnson goes up for the grab. Comes down with the ball. He's got his butt on the turf. His knee touches, but he has to have possession of the ball as he hits the ground. He loses control. Replay officials confirm the call on the field. Jim Schwartz arguing this one. Here's third and four with Rodgers. Calmly retreating, looking for something. Flag is down as he throws to the end zone. Incomplete. Illegal use of hands, hands to the face, defense, number 90, five yard penalty from the previous spot, first down Green Bay. Comes towards there, it is, coming there. But uh, again, where? That's he's all... on the left shoulder once yeah, again. Uh, again. The left... And this is it with Trey Flowers. It, it, it's a headline story, week in and week out. Book, I get it, I get it. Mistakes are going to be made, but you know what? We're inside shoulder pads, we're on shoulders here. Just a tough miss. It, it just can't happen, though. Because... Called twice tonight and at the most critical juncture to give them the... They bring four. Quickly getting it to the running back who loses control of the ball that time. Carry on Johnson. Let's three, see. Three steps down with Ruling possession. The play, that there was a reception. The, re the receiver forward the ball. After review the play, it is an incomplete pass as the receiver never gained control of the ball. And he fourth down at the... He back out of the blitz. And then it's Thomas, and he's going to reach for it. And is he down before the ball came loose? They're going to rule it at the yeah. moment. He is down. He's down. down at the 41. On Mathis. Where is he down? It is challengeable. I don't see anything down. Monday Night Football coming down to this play. Calvin Johnson appeared to be headed into the end zone. Now, a couple of different aspects of this play, guys. One, the all-world play by Cam Chancellor to knock it loose. But K.J. Wright at the end, you'll see, punches the football out of bounds.
to get the touch back. We're, we're trying to get Dean Blandino, the uh, vice president of officiating, on the phone to confirm. Take us through this play uh, in terms of the rule. Are you allowed to, to bat the football out uh, once you're in the end zone, as we saw from K.J. Wright? Yeah, so you can't bat the ball in any direction in the end zone, either end zone. So K.J. Wright batted the football. That is a foul for an illegal bat. Um, the back judge was on the play. In his judgment, he didn't feel it was an overt act, so he didn't throw the flag. Uh, and looking at the replays, it did look like a bat. And uh, so the enforcement would be basically we'd go back to the spot of the fumble and Detroit would keep the football. No Michael Parsons, but Goff had to get the ball out as well. Dan Skipper, an extra offensive lineman, comes in. Play action. End zone. There it is! Unbelievable! The two-point try is good, and it's Taylor Decker. What else could it be? Touching by number 68. So the call is an illegal touch. I think number 70 and number 68 came in. Stafford's throw. Catch me. Touchdown Lions! It's Golden Tate, and they lead for the first time today. Reviewing the play, the ruling on the field has changed. The runner was, was touched down at the half a yard line. He was short of the goal line. By would go back to a running clock and we have a 10 second runoff so by rule the game is over you can't end the game that way he hit his last eight passes before that one and here they go with four seven he didn't think he was down and he's still going and the officials are acting like it's still a live play for set taking it all the way and still no signal that he was down you cannot hear the whistle on the field there's already a challenge flag out which you don't need to challenge a touchdown all plays have to be verified but schwartz emptied out the pocket it doesn't matter. You can't challenge a touchdown. They get reviewed anyway. Is there any way he's down? Elbow, forearm, he's going to be down. Yes, he is down. Now the question is, will they mark off a penalty on Jim Schwartz for throwing the challenge flag? The result of the play is a touchdown. Not the play long. is not reviewable. Detroit. It'll be a 15-yard penalty on the kickoff, but the play is not reviewable. Touchdown.